Hello, I'm Frixius, creator of Neos VR, and I have a small update for you. One of the recent additions is support for convex colliders and approximate convex decomposition using the VHACD version 2.0 algorithm. If you have any mesh using a standard mesh collider, it's going to behave as a thin shell without a volume, during collisions, and can be potentially inefficient. To solve this, you can open the convex decomposition dialog using the inspector and perform convex decomposition. As you can see, the original shape has been approximated using a set of convex hulls, each behaving as an object with volume. If the approximation isn't good enough, you can simply remove the generated hulls, tweak the settings, and run the process again, all from within VR. The decomposition process works on any imported mesh, for example this Klein bottle model with self-intersection, or this mushroom 3D scan. If the target object is split into multiple meshes, you can bake them first using the glue tool. Once baked into a single mesh, you can perform the convex decomposition as usual. It works on meshes generated procedurally within NEOS as well, like this brushstroke. Here's a highly detailed model of a brain. As you can see, a running convex decomposition approximates its shape with significantly simpler geometry. This new tool is available in the latest build of NEOS on Steam, so feel free to experiment with it and use it for your work, whether as part of NEOS world building or as part of your workflow by exporting the generated hulls. If you have any questions or want to see the latest updates, I recommend joining our Discord. We can also support development of NEOS on Patreon. Every dollar helps. We also have an ongoing ICO for NCR, our cryptocurrency token that enables our community to trade items and services in our metaverse. Thank you very much for watching, and see you next time.